It's not summer yet, but we're seeing a bit of everything summer has with it. We're seeing some clouds, mm -hmm. some warmth, some rain. Love yeah, it. it's not officially summer, but boy, Anne, it sure feels like it. And this weekend, yeah. there's all sorts of fun events happening for folks to get out and enjoy. Lots of things going on this weekend. And I think really the daytime hours, both Saturday and Sunday, uh, you'll be good to go. And even today worked out where most of the rain stayed well to our west and northwest. So we've been fairly dry today. If you're planning to head out tonight, there could be a few more isolated showers or maybe a rumble of thunder out there. But most of the significant heavier rain is across western and northwestern Iowa Saturday and Sunday temperatures will be into the low to mid 80s. I think Saturday we stay dry. It looks really great, especially tomorrow afternoon. Sunday we've got the chance for some rain, but that's later uh, in the day. I think it's going to come after sunset overnight Sunday into Monday, but we've got rain showers and a few thunderstorms on the radar right now. Again, heaviest rain back across northwest Iowa and then into uh, eastern portions of Nebraska. We've had uh, some downpours here kind of focused across the same area, so some ponding on the roadway, some localized flooding can't be ruled out in some spots across northwest Iowa where we've got those downpours lingering like Kasuth County up towards Algona back down towards Storm Lake, Fort Dodge and then over towards Spencer as well. Closer to central Iowa, it's been very light activity that's kind of fizzled out as it's tried to make its way into the metro. But again, an isolated shower or two are possible here later on today and into the evening hours tonight. Eventually we'll dry things out the places that do see the rain. It comes to an end overnight tonight. We're near 80 for a lot of spots cooler where the rain and clouds have uh, been around for most of the day, like Carroll and Audubon in the upper 60s to low 70s, closer to 80 here in Des Moines, 77 right now in Ankeny. Next 12 hours will probably stay the same like what we've seen for much of the day today. A mostly cloudy sky here through the early evening, a chance for a sprinkle or two temperatures fall back into the low 60s by tomorrow morning. So it is a uh, warm start to our weekend. Again, we're into the 80s here as we go into Saturday and Sunday. Rain chances again dwindle overnight tonight. Clouds linger at least to the first for the first part of the day on Saturday. We could see some more rain kind of bubble up here across eastern Iowa tomorrow morning. Central and western Iowa were dry for a good portion of the day on Saturday. We'll clear things out and then we go into the day on Sunday. Again, I think daylight hours Sunday are going to stay dry, but then we've got a complex of storms moving across Nebraska and South Dakota that eventually come in by late Sunday into early Monday morning. So I think that'll be our next chance for some widespread uh, rain and storm activity. We start off with the clouds tomorrow. If you're heading to the principal charity classic, we'll be in the mid 70s by lunchtime and then by the evening hours we will hang out in the low 80s. Tonight's forecast takes us back into the low 60s downtown farmers market tomorrow. I think things will be good to go early on. We'll see some sun breaks by lunchtime and again we warm up quickly tomorrow. Low 80s on tap here as we head into the sat into our Saturday eight day forecast keeps us in the 80s Monday and Tuesday better chance for storms Monday and then again late Tuesday into Wednesday.